Hi, welcome to Comet Knowledge Sharing Program. This is Ilan Chadian, Technical Director at Comet Computers of Private Limited. In this video, we'll be understanding hard disk and the file system. And now we'll be discussing how the data is stored in a hard disk. So we all know hard disk is a, a sealed unit containing a number of uh, platers in a stack. Electromagnetic read and write heads are positioned above and below each plater. As the plater spins, the drive heads move in towards the center of the surface and out towards the edge of the surface. In this way, the drive heads can reach the entire surface of each plater. On a hard disk, data is stored in thin concentric bands. A drive head while in one position can read or write a circular ring or a band called as a track. This, there can be more than a thousand uh, tracks in a 3.5 inch hard disk. Sections within each track are called as sectors. A sector is the smallest physical storage unit on a disk and is almost 512 bytes in size. A sector is the smallest uh, physical storage unit on the disk. In Windows, the size of each sector will be 512 bytes. And cluster is a group of or one or more contiguous sectors and it is called a cluster. And uh, volume, a logical partitioning uh, of a hard disk consisting of one or more cluster, which we call it as a volume. So volume consists of uh, files, system information and unallocated space that can be allocated to the files. And now we'll be understanding about the file system. A file system is nothing but the manner in which the files are named and logically placed for storage and retrieval. So it can be considered as a database or an index that contains the physical location of every single piece of data on the respective storage device. File system maintains file system table in which the address of each cluster and name of the files stored in the cluster are maintained. When a file is open, operating system searches for file name and its cluster address in the file uh, of the file location in the entire file system table. After locating the cluster address of the file name, the data is loaded from hard disk to RAM for further processing. For storing and retrieve the, retrieving the files, the file system also makes use of the metadata which includes the date when the file is created, date modified and the file size and so on. They can also uh, restrict uh, users from accessing a particular file by using uh, encryption or password or any other mechanisms. So files are stored on the storage media in sectors. The unused sectors can be utilized for storing uh, uh, new data, typically uh, uh, done in uh, sector groups known as uh, uh, blocks. The file system identifies the file size, position, and the sectors that are available for storage. If a structure of organizing files wouldn't exist, it would not be possible to store or delete or retrieve any files in the hard disk. And uh, this is the uh, image which shows uh, how the file system looks like. So here you can see the uh, cluster address is maintained and against the cluster address the file or uh, the data are uh, present. So this is how the file system maintains the data in the hard disk. And I believe you uh, got a good understanding on a hard disk, how the data are stored and how the data are retrieved and also you got a good understanding on the file system. So thanks for watching this video and do like and share the video and also subscribe our channel. Thank you all. Bye bye.